Hi there guys, now I have a question for you. Do you also struggle to find your friends' pictures to post on social media on their birthdays? I mean, hota hai, right? Maybe it's on a hard drive or a pen drive that we just can't find. Maybe we bought a new phone and that picture is just not there. What to do? Let me tell you the solution. Google Photos. And that's not all. Google Photos has so many more features and tricks as well that can take your photo experience to the next level. Let me show you how. Search for people, places and objects. Have you ever spent hours scrolling through your photo gallery trying to find a specific picture? It can be so frustrating and time consuming, right? But what if I told you that Google Photos can make your life easier? You heard that right guys. Google Photos uses advanced machine learning to recognize and tag your images automatically. So no more endless scrolling. Just type in what you're looking for and that's it. You'll find all the related videos and pictures. It can also detect text in your images, which is also surprisingly useful. Whether you're searching for pictures of your furry friend, receipts or even memes, Google Photos has got your back. Search photos by emoji. Did you know that you can also search for photos in Google Photos using emojis? I mean, how cool is that? Emojis aren't just for texting anymore. Simply type in an emoji in the search bar and Google Photos will display all the related images. Want to see all the pictures of your pet? Just type in the paw print emoji. I mean, how cute is that? Looking for pictures from a vacation? Try searching with the beach or mountain emoji. The best part is that it works with the most common emojis and it's an entertaining way to find pictures that you might have forgotten about. Manually edit labels. Have you ever had a situation where Google Photos mislabeled someone in a photo? It can be a bit frustrating, but don't worry. It's an easy fix. Just follow these simple steps. First, open the photo in question and tap the three dot menu at the top or swipe up from the bottom. You should see the faces of the people in the photo. Next, click on the edit icon next to the mislabeled person's face. From there, you can remove or change the label as needed. It's as simple as that. Move photos to archive. Don't you hate it when you're scrolling through your photo gallery and suddenly you see a random screenshot or a blurry picture of a street sign? It can be frustrating to have to sit through all those images to find that one picture that you actually want. But worry not, because Google Photos has the solution, archiving. Archiving photos is like putting them in a virtual storage closet. You don't have to delete them, but they're not in your face every time you open the app. To archive a photo, just select it, tap the three dot menu and click on archive. Easy peasy. And the best part, Google Photos will periodically remind you to archive any unnecessary photos to keep your gallery clean and clutter free. So no more random screenshots or receipts hogging your previous gallery space or eight pictures of that one friend who just keeps saying, ek aur photo lena, ek aur le, ek aur le, ek aur. How to hide photos and videos in Google Photos. We all have those embarrassing or slightly sensitive photos or videos that we don't want anyone else to see. I mean, it could be a video of you singing off-key to your favorite song or a photo of your messy room that you don't want any of your friends to see. Whatever be the reason, Google Photos has got you covered. First, open the app and find the photo or video that you want to keep hidden. Tap on it and you'll see three dots in the top right corner. Tap on those dots and a list of options will appear. Just tap on the move to the lock folder. If you haven't already set up this feature, the app will ask you to authenticate with a fingerprint. This is to make sure that only you can access the locked folder. Once you've done that, you'll be reminded that the copies and edits of the photo or video won't be automatically locked away and that locked items will be deleted if you uninstall photos. Tap continue. Another confirmation screen will pop up. Don't worry, you're almost there. Just tap move. The last step is to let photos modify the image or video, so tap allow. If you are a first user, you'll get a pop of don't ask me again. Your photo or video is now safely tucked away in the locked folder. And that was the video guys. With these Google Photos tips and tricks, you're now equipped to organize, search and secure your precious memories like a pro. So start exploring and using these features to get the most out of Google Photos today. Do share your thoughts with us on this video and keep watching this space for more such content. See you in the next one.